A female Mexican wolf who became famous for traveling long distances is being kept in captivity until she can breed. The wolf, known as Asha, is currently at a U.S. Fish and Wildlife facility in Socorro. News 13's Jessica Barron spoke with an environmental group who says Asha should be released. Do is that they need to stop thinking of every wolf as a means to an end to meet their recovery goal. That is what one environmental group has to say about the decision to keep a female Mexican wolf in captivity. Last week, the U.S. Fish and Wildlife announced they would not be releasing the three-year-old wolf, Asha, until she successfully breeds, something environmental groups say is not right. The thing is, she's an individual animal who deserves her freedom. She is a wild animal that they're keeping in captivity for the sake of breeding, but Wolves play an important ecological role on the landscape, too. Asha became well known after she left her federal government designated land located south of I-40 in New Mexico in January 2023. The boundary is called the Mexican Wolf Experimental Project Area, which is meant to monitor the wolf population. She was caught and moved back to Arizona, but in October she was roaming outside the area again. She's clearly shown that she has this adventurous instinct in her. Asha was seen traveling near the San Pedro Mountains and the Valles Caldera National Preserve. Fish and Wildlife then captured her, saying it was to ensure her safety. The plan was to release her this year, but since she hasn't bred, the plans have changed. Advocates with the Western Watersheds Project say it's unfair to Asha, adding that confining her to a small space could hurt her physical abilities to travel far. What they really need to do is adjust the management boundaries so that they allow more flexibility and let the wolves show us what they want instead of forcing them into the model of what humans want. Jessica Barron, Caracuy News 13. If you'd like to learn more about the Western Watersheds Project, you can visit their website. We have a link at alwaysoncaracuy.com.